the way God set things up is 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 perfectly ordered. Okay? Then, okay, so let's keep reading. Husbands, love your wives and do not embitter against them. Embitter means be piercing or sharp. I that, that that's my area of, of uh struggle. Stacy tells me she says, What's the not what you say, it's how you say it. It's not what you say, it's I'm piercing and I'm sharp. And that's that God himself says this. Don't do that. He says, love your wives. So if I have to love my wife and say something that is maybe not uh, she wants to hear or whatever, but if I'm saying it out of love and I truly believe it's something that God has put in my heart to share, I'm not to come with a hammer or a pick. Think about, we, we always talk about how selfish we are. And, and to the negative light, we are selfish. But what if we made it a positive thing to be selfish and actually treated our wives selfishly? What if we treated them better as good as we treat ourselves? Think about that. And I'm just as guilty. There's not a, I, I, man, I, I, there's not a man. I, there's very few. I've met a couple of them. But most men, man, just... My Uncle Bobby was not perfect by any stretch of the imagination. But let me tell you something. That man took care of his wife. He took care of my Aunt Jerry, man. He, <laughs> this woman, after he passed away, this woman was hooked on that man. She said, she said, because uh, people, you know, she's she's an older, she wasn't that much older, but she's in her uh, 60s and all that kind of stuff, late 60s. And she said, I'm never going to remarry. She's going to die, Bobby Joe Davis. Miss Bobby Joe Davis. She said, I'm going to die. Miss Bobby Joe Davis. Not because uh, he was some little warlord. But no, I was there. I saw it. This man, he would get up He would get up and fix her breakfast. She had. She battled, she battled uh, diabetes. And he'd fix her breakfast. He'd take care of her food. Whatever she needed, man. And some of my family made fun of her. Behind her back, of course. Or, but she knew she wasn't stupid. But why? Because that man loved her so much that he took care of her, that treated her better than he treated himself. And I'm not joking when I say that. Because this man took care of himself. But let me tell you something. He took care of I mean, it. Was, it was a beautiful thing. He was, he was a flawed man. Flawed. I can tell you numerous things. But let me tell you something. The area he wasn't flawed in was what God said to do with his wife. The area I can learn from, and I try to. 